I'm Alex. And how tall are you? I am 6'3". Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm with Alex. Alex is a model, uh, recently moved to Los Angeles. Um, so I met Alex actually at a casting for Los Angeles Fashion Week. And um, I asked him to be part of this video and you know, thankfully he agreed. So welcome to my channel, Alex. Thank you. Um, so what I want to do today is I want to help Alex improve his walk. So what Alex is going to do is, he, is he's going to walk for us and I'm going to give him a few pointers and hopefully by the pointers that I give him, hopefully you guys can pick up some tips as well and hopefully use it to improve your walk. All right, so that was Alex's first walk. Um, and there are a couple of things that I noticed just from that uh, walk that he just did. And I want to see if we can correct those things. Um, one thing that I noticed, obviously your shoelaces are untied, so maybe that impacts the way you're walking. But um, one thing that I noticed was that when Alex was walking, um, his feet were almost kind of like pointing outwards. And it was almost like, um, it was almost like you were dragging it a little bit mm -hmm. as you were walking. So one correction that I would like to um, point out is that try to have your toes pointed forward and almost lift your feet higher a little bit, a little bit higher. Um, second thing I'd like to point out is um, your arms felt uh, like it was swinging just a little bit too much. So try, I mean, you can still swing it naturally, but try to, um, I guess, stiffen up a little bit, you know. Um, Next thing I noticed was also the face. So try to be more fierce. Yeah. Have a central, a central focal point down at the end of the runway because you have to keep in mind that um, as you're walking down the runway, there are photographers at the end taking pictures and you want to look fierce um, on every shot, right? So try to keep a fierce look like you're posing or you're walking and you're walking with purpose and just, just be more fierce, I guess. So um, we're going to have Alex try it again and we'll see if we can uh, make some improvements this time. All right, obviously that was a much better walk from Alex. Um, now just a couple more tiny tweaks and then I think he's there. Um, Another thing was that um, uh, your face was better, um, but maybe you should be try to be more fierce in the face. That was that was way better than the first time. Uh, so try to be more fierce in the face, almost like you're you're having an attitude, right? So you're walking with an attitude. And then the other thing that I noticed was um, your back. Um, try to keep your, especially your upper back. Try to keep your upper back straighter. Um, so almost like your chest out, and you know keep your back straight because when you were walking, it was almost like, like that. It's like your, your shoulders were uh, hunched over forward. So try to keep the back straight, um, fierce face. And your stop was good. Um, it was definitely good. And I liked the look that you gave at the end. Like you held it for like a second and a half and then you turned back. So that was good. Um, so just those two, two things and then I think we're there. So what I want to do is I want to give Alex just a little bit of character to his walk so he can have uh, that signature walk and hopefully perfect it as he goes on in his career. All right, so that was the walk with Alex. Um, so just as a recap, uh, one thing that I told him to do was to make sure that his toes were pointed forward, um, making sure that the back is straight and uh, trying not to swing the arms way too much. And I also gave him a few pointers on making the stop at the end of the runway and you know, keeping in mind that you're being photographed as you're walking, so your face has to be fierce the entire time. Um, keeping that stop 
uh, one and a half seconds long and turn it around while your eyes are still pointed down the runway. Um, so I think those, those tips that I just gave Alex um, really helped improve his walk as you guys can see in the video. Um, so if you guys like this video, feel free to hit us with a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. How did you get into modeling? Uh, I got into modeling in high school going to freshman year. I followed uh, one of my favorite models on Instagram and ever since then he inspired me to make the move out here in LA and pursue that career. And um, what do you, since you've been in Los Angeles, what do you think about the modeling industry? You know, where are you? Are you signed? Are you not signed? What, do you, what are your uh, goals? I am currently not signed. I am working on building my portfolio. And so far, my opinion on the industry, it's really hard and complicated. There's a lot of good models here, and it's really kind of like a competition who can fight and work the way to the top. And that's my opinion.